Welcome back, guys. We are here again at the defense. Wow, that was loud. Defense of D-Day here. Um, and guys, we're doing our absolute best. Now, it looks like our frontline troops have already run out of ammunition. In fact, sorry, guys. I want to turn that down just a little bit. I don't know if it's just me, but that thing is way too loud. Yeah. Master Valiant decided to jump up on its own. Um, we want to take back these three guys at the front because they're out of ammunition. So we're going to bring them back to the truck. Uh, and hopefully they make it there without getting shot. Unlikely. Actually, one of these guys is fine. We're going to keep him there. We'll bring this guy back to get those reinforcements. Keep up the fire, man. Oh, shit. He's down, too. He just lost his helmet. Mein helm. Move faster. All right. There we go. And we can still bring in some more units. But right now, I think I'm going to hold out. Look at that gun. We've also got a few guys over here on the right that could probably do with getting a little closer to the center. But just in case they get too close, we've got infantry here in the marshes to protect against the, their possible advance. I'm not too concerned. And we've got another wave of ships coming. Let's see when they're going to start sending armored vehicles. That's what I really want to know. And they might not send them for a while. Looks like they're going to send another wave of infantry to get massacred on the beach. Foyo! Oh, yes. Alright, we're firing the 88 right now. Come on! Oh, it's too fun. Alright, let's go ahead and get over to the MG guy. Actually, he's already getting some great shots. This is just a single heavy machine gun unit. Don't be Americana! We must not allow the allies to get this far. Ice golf. Oh, what? Did I turn into a German again? God damn it. It happens every time. All right, let's take a look now, guys. We can probably... Oh, wait a minute. No, no supply truck. So I guess we have to wait for the two-time supply income, because this is going to double our supply income uh, to be able to build more units. Which is kind of cool. It's going to hopefully allow us to build that war factory. Because I'm assuming the enemy is going to eventually... I'm not I'm not saying right now, but eventually they're going to be getting some tanks. Let's move this machine gun forward. It might be harder to get out of here. We're going to have to go out back out this way, kind of. And actually, I wouldn't mind putting them right where the sandbag is. So let's see if we can get them there. Gotta get some ammunition to that central machine gun. I'm not sure how we do that. Oh, okay. These guys all have automatic ammunition because the mortar also has zero. British troops. Oh my goodness, guys. We might have some British troops landing. Let's see. Nope, still Americans. That sounded very English, though. Englander! Well. Gotta move this guy up even more. Let's put him up here on this hill. Yes, beautiful boys. Again, he can't fire. What the hell is going on with this Alright, let's take a look over here, guys. Um, we can get some more infantry, or we could start buying that heavy factory. Everyone fire! They're right on us here. I'm actually going to bring in another MG team and put it over here in the marshlands. They're almost right on top of us. We've got to intensify that fire. Come on, boys. Right, let's grab the infantry we have back here. There's a reason they've arrived. Moves them into some marsh. Scheisse. We really don't want them cutting through the barbed wire, especially not this early. Get down there, boys. And yeah, once again, the machine guns are not firing. Try to move them up even more, I guess. It could just mean that this thing is out of ammo, but all our M MGs are out of ammo right now. So, unless we can bring in an ammo truck, uh, trying to get it in through the light vehicles. Opel Blitz, that's what we need. We're going to bring in the Opel Blitz. 
immediately. Hopefully he can make it here soon. And that's what I was trying to go for, but instead I took the upgraded um, ammo, which is not something we wanted. Oh yeah! We can move this AA gun up to a better position. Scheiß mena. Gets the machine gun up! Alright, they've moved our guys off the mortar, guys. They're on the beach. They're really close to uh, getting onto the bunker now. We better fix this. What are you waiting for? Fool. Get down here. We'll get them on all fours. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Get some Ulrich. Shit, Ulrich is down. Alright, we just can't let them get right up on us. Bullets. Look at that, guys. Right on the beach. And this is one of the reasons why we brought these infantry over, because we knew that this would eventually happen. Open fire! Lay down on all fours! Mm-hmm. I love it. Beautiful. Look at them tumbling down that hill. We're going to go ahead and bring in some more guys, maybe some light vehicles. We've got the Opal Blitz on the way to provide some, uh, of course, our, our, uh, excuse me, ammo. <laughs> um, uh, but we want to bring in some more support units. I'm bringing in some mortars for sure. The mortars are going to help us bombard these guys. And maybe even a flat cannon right there. Get the rest of these guys out. Bullet, man. We're going to just send out a huge pack of them. Go, men. Bring Terra to the enemy! One just gets shot, one is the other, you know, whichever you feel like it. Oh, they threw a grenade! Oh, shit! Alright, the British are right on us, guys. Now, remember, this is our first attempt at defending on D-Day. It might not be our best. Alright, they're moving up the center here. Could definitely get some infantry units in. And I thought we had too many infantry. One good reason we kept these blocking units back here. Bring an MG team. And we've got a secondary defensive position here with a lot of heavy guns. Let's pop back a bit. Looks like our guys are moving up, but they're taking their sweet-ass time. We've even got some enemies that have cut through here. Problem is these reinforcements arrive very, very late. So we're gonna start sending a second defensive line over here. Come on, man, don't let them take the center. Keep on shooting. Go in there. Sacrifice for the Reich. I like it. I like it a lot. I always think this is Battle of Empires to start left-clicking. Right-click. Go, boys, go. Oh my goodness, we've got a Sherman behind us! How did this guy not see the Sherman? That's what I want to know. How did he not see the Sherman? And this is one of the reasons we should have gotten that heavy weapons factory. Alright, well right now we have an enemy Sherman tank behind us. Let's see what we can do about this, if anything. Alright, we do have a pack gun. So, we're gonna move forward the pack gun. A lot of these weapons are back here, sort of just waiting to be used. Artillery incoming! Oh, oh, oh! The enemy artillery is finally coming in to D-Day. Just gonna wipe the bunkers out for sure. Holy shit! Oh yeah, baby! I knew they would send them eventually. And yes, those bombs are incoming. Holy crap. Shall not surrender, man. Not till the very end. 
With no anti-tank weapons, or barely any. We could bring in an AT team. Alright, we need these guys to move up a lot faster. So I'm going to grab these guys specifically and just order them forward. Let's order them to the second line of trenches. Actually, no. We'll put them in the first. They can deal with this. Full left! That left side definitely looks untenable. But we will not stop trying to defend it. Here in the center, we're also having a lot of issues. So we might want to grab this guy and actually move him, move these guys right here. Where the sandbags are. We've got so much armor coming at us. Shit. Maybe we want to get behind these sandbags. Oh yeah! Yeah, get into the sandbags, it's too late. Some of our guys will keep moving forward. Hope we can get them in that bunker before the tank gets here. And no anti-tank units, not even a rocket launcher. Come on, man, you have to have something to kill the tank. We're going to try to get past them and into the bunker here. Pack gun's going to take forever to get here. And this isn't even the pack gun. This is just the AA gun. Let's see how the center's going. Hold it, boys. They're still holding this brave, man. We're going to bring in some more to... If we could get them right there, that would be amazing. Of course, that tank's there, so let's actually push them over here. Oh shit, we've got enemies right there. Well, we know that we're going to be storming a position, that's for sure. Let's get on this side. They're trying to destroy the supply truck. Holy shit! Return fire! So in the field with us, boys. Get into the trench. This guy might still be able to get in that position we put him in. Okay. Incredibly, some of our boys still hold the beach, but enemies behind us makes our job a lot harder. There we go, boys. Return fire. More. Shit! Some nice shots right down the line. Those are gonna take their toll. Let's take a look over here and see if there's any contacts. Alright, we do have our pack gun out. But he's damaged. <laughs> Badly damaged. And incredibly, they're just now getting our to our supply gun. Looks like we destroyed the hull. Unbelievable. So our pack gun is still getting some hits. Wow. It might just be an M3 half track. I think it is, but a kill is a kill. And actually, that's a big gun. Wow. Good job, pack. So we're going to turn him back this way. Maybe that's a sign to get another one of these bastards. Might be too late for that, though. Could get a pack 36 and put him right there. Right here, actually. Oh shit, we got the tank on us, and once again, no anti-tank weapons. Except for those AT, um, AT units, which I don't see any right now. There we go, crew injured, unbelievable. Cr incredible fighting by our men. Wow. We have to give it to them there. That was pretty awesome. We're gonna bring back one of our units, guys, because I don't like the enemy being behind us here. Boy up. We can get one nade out there into this position. They all seem to be in the same area. So if we... Oh, damn it. Just get, no, there's no way. There's no way. Too much fire on that position right now. I definitely wish I had invested in the heavy factory. It's a bit late for that now, though. Go ahead and repair the pack. There's only one guy on the pack. Into position, men. 
So beach has not been taken yet. We're going to position these guys over here and hopefully they can take out the remainder of the enemy. Oh, it's the last man on the left side. Okay. Our AA gun knows what's up, so he's going to fire at anything on that left side, but obviously that's not enough. And I wonder if there's any ammo left in that big gun. I doubt it, but it might scare the enemy enough to slow them down a bit. That's what we would need to destroy the tanks. Oh, they're turning towards the tanks. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Injuring the crew. Keep it up, boys. Keep it up. Mein Gott. Not gonna last too long, but while it does, we're gonna enjoy it. Nice! Look at that track, guys. Absolutely blew the hell out of these guys. We're gonna throw a nade right down their throats, too, if we can. If not, I actually wanna get this guy just get him in position. Cause some um, sort of guerrilla tactics against the enemy, get behind their lines, and cause some problems. Throw it! Good work, Ludwig! I don't actually know if your name was Ludwig, but I just guess it is. <laughs> there we go. Alright, not bad. Like I said, this is our first time defending. So now we're going to have to pull back our lines, of course. Where's that second pack gun? Second pack gun is on the way. Alright, nice. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to form a second defensive line right here. We'll get some uh, heavy machine guns. We'll get another pack gun to go behind the line. And we're just going to have to wait out. As for the invading men, we will have a second defensive line here. So they're still going to have to pass through. And in fact, they've got this M1A1 or M115. M15A1. And I think we can take it out. Boom. This is a uh, AT team, so they know how to deal with this. Yes! Good work, mana. Alright, let's see our guys on the left. Still fighting as hard as ever. Alright, the AA gun is hot, guys. These guys over here in the sandbags. It's actually going to be a better position for the machine gun. It'll fire a lot better. Bring forward, grab these boys. Go, boys, go! Oh shit, they took out the AA gun. Hope they can even make it to the trench. Now they need to throw a grenade right at that first trench. Damn. Unbelievable, man. rocket launcher out on that Sherman. Get a rocket launcher out on that Sherman. Nice. He got him with one hit, but it didn't do a damn thing. Bounce right off him. I hope you have repaired this, this pack. Aim at the tanker. Yeah, that's is good. This might actually be... No, there's no way he's going to be able to hit it from this distance. Wow, they're advancing, guys. We're going to have to rely on that secondary line of defense back here. And actually, I wouldn't it wouldn't hurt at all to have an AA unit here, too. So let's see if we can get an AT, excuse me, an AT unit. We're going to try to get an AT team here. Move the rest of these guys up. Incoming artillery. Some more artillery incoming. So we have a lot of stuff we could bring here to the front. Just not sure if it's going to be enough to stop it, stop any of the enemy advances. What would be great is if we could have sent some guys to defend this area. This looks like a nice point of uh, of defense. Why won't this water move up? Move up, water. There you go. He just needed a little coaxing from Zafura. Get a machine gun team. Pretty soon, we should see the advance of the enemy. It's 
So far, we're still holding this position a little bit, stopping some of the infantry. And there's no doubt that we left the beach in utter mess. It's too bad the bodies don't stay around, but if they did, I think that the game would crash. Um, still, they finally took that right side after much fighting. But it took them a while, for sure. This Americana did not fight without uh, some casualties. Pack guns out this way. One of these mortars I want to get back here. Alright, this, believe it or not, wow, there's an AT gun back here. We've got to take that. But that's going to be wasting an AT team. Um, I'm going to try to put, sorry, a machine gun team. I'm going to try to put this machine gun team right there. I don't know if they can get there in time, but if they can, then obviously that's a secondary line of defense. It'll improve our odds a little bit. I'll try to get a mortar behind it. And we're hoping that we're going to get that infantry squad. Hopefully we'll unlock enough points to grab it, because then we could take that AT gun and have even more defense, which is pretty great. It's too bad we can't control that gun right there. But we forgot this stuff. Like, for instance, an SDKVZ armored vehicle. I didn't even realize this was around. Could have been using this shit, guys. Maybe next time we'll remember, yeah? Alright, I'm gonna take a few of these guys to crew the SDKFZ. Let's go for it. It's our secondary machine gun team, and I'm gonna put them out here as well. We want this central area to become a point of contention. Anyway, guys, I hope you're enjoying the video, uh, the campaign, etc. Holy crap. <laughs> Um, actually, this is an AA gun. It was still able to kill a tank, though. But if you are, make sure to leave that in the comments down below, and we will continue this in the next episode. Only 23 minutes left to defend. Can we hold it? I'm not so sure. Take care, guys.